Welcome back to Kelsey and Kylie Vlogs. Um, so today I thought it would be a good idea to read my future. What? Is that what it's called? Like the palm reading stuff and like... Oh, the cat wants to be in the video. Come on, Mel. Come on. You know what? We're just going to do it. Um, so anyway, that was a really good explanation. Um, I'm probably going to try to make Kylie do this next week so you can see her future. But I have this app called Live Palm Mystery. And it's not sponsored. So obviously, it's more not that cool. I'm just going to screen record here in two seconds once I exit out of all ads. Oh, there's a cat hair everywhere. Um... Okay, so you already had to put your birthday and stuff in, and like the time you were born, and I just did that on my own because I am not that smart. Okay? <laughs> I don't know. So, uh, first of all, we're gonna look. Mm, I don't like horoscopes. So, we're not gonna do that one. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna do the palm reading. Hold on, I gotta watch an ad. Because I ain't paying for any apps. Well, this is fun. <laughs> How's your day? Interesting. <laughs> Take a photo of my left palm. Oh. Now I gotta do my right palm. Well, this is more confusing than I thought it would be. I thought it was just a one hand thing. I just want to know what's gonna happen in the future. Actually, I don't even know if I want to know. I don't really know if I believe these. I mean, I don't really believe these apps, but I guess we'll find out. Maybe I'll do like a in the future video and like come back and tell you whether this stuff is correct or not. That means two hours. Yeah, heck to the no. Maybe I should use a different app. I just was trying to look at my health and I don't know what else. Well, I'm having a blast, aren't you? I'm back. <laughs> um, it's like a lot of time later, a lot of hours later because the camera battery died and then I uh, went eight and stuff, so. Anyway, now we're gonna screen record, actually do it this time. Okay, and then we'll go on to live palmistry because now my fingerprints, my fingerprints, my palm pictures <laughs> have been in there for a long enough time. So it should be ready. Okay, 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 okay. Never mind. My results are in. Okay, so for my lifetime, the value of value of the lifetime, I don't know what that means. Says Kelsey, you're very blunt and outspoken, often to the point to most sensitive souls around you that most sensitive souls around you will become alienated. You can always use your inner strength to face any challenge. You're very competitive and never lose sight in what is in your best interest. Um, I don't know if that's very accurate. <laughs> um, I'm very like to the point, like I don't beat around the bush. I'll just tell you straight up how I feel about something. But I wouldn't say I'm very competitive, and I'm not very, like, loud, I guess. <laughs> so, I don't know about that one. <laughs> um, so then it says, lifeline. Your line indicates self-resilience and resourcefulness in making choices about your purpose in life. Chance and family connections are not 
depended on upon, upon for career, what you do in your life, and how time is spent. The main challenge for you is to stick with your own values and live life independently from past or present family influence. I don't know. I'm, so far, I'm not like on board with this. <laughs> uh, it's kind of true. Like I'd say career and family stuff are pretty separate. Um, but I'm also, I don't know. Let's just move on. Headline. Um, the line shows that you need to seek your own independence in order to grow closer to things that you love. Always leave some time for yourself. Patience may not be your strongest suit, but it takes time to figure out what you truly want and what you truly need. Kelsey, there's a huge difference between those two things. Please reval or keep reevaluating whether you still want the person or goal that you've been waiting for so long. Don't be afraid to change your life at any stage. I'd say that's pretty accurate. I do take time to make decisions. Yeah. Okay, that's the first one where I'm like, yeah, that's pretty true. Heartline. Sorry. <laughs> um, you're capable of being excited, passionate, and are prone to fall in love very easily. Some marks on the heartline mean that you enjoy... Oh, okay. Well, that part's not true. <laughs> you have no problem in attracting lovers. You are very passionate and open to other people. This trait of character will be lost if you decide to look for a partner for life. This will cause you to be loyal, caring, and love your partner forever. Um, I don't know how to respond to that. <laughs> I think I'm loyal. <laughs> okay, next. <laughs> Special marks. Your marks tell us that you are very independent, but you need something to control and someone to admire and appreciate you. You are fully capable of being greatly successful on your own, um, but you are much happier if you have an audience and following people who look up to you. You would prefer not to be alone. I'd say that's pretty accurate. I just want to know, like, how long you had to, like, live and stuff. Okay, that's kind of dark. Maybe that's not what I meant. But like, I don't know what I mean. I don't know where that cut off. So I did this tarot card reading website online and I was reading the part about love and it says in the past you have experienced equivalent situations when everything just seemed to be getting on top of you. At this time you knew how to count on the support of your loved ones by giving them your trust. Today the cards invoke the influence of an older man. He seems to monopolize your thoughts and should help you to take things in hand, it is not always easy to get your bearings when you encounter an unexpected situation, but this man will be there for you to help you find the right path and make the right decisions during this crucial period. You should keep your goals in mind and take the advice of this draft so that all the odds are in your favor. In August 2019, you will need to be aware of the issues raised in this draft to advance to a happier situation in love and in your personal life. Um... That's kind of creepy <laughs> because I think in the past I have really depended on like my family and my friends and I'm creeped out. <laughs> so
So I don't know if that means like an older man, which I don't know who that would be, but like technically my boyfriend is older than me. So is that what that means? If it is, then that's creepy. I'm gonna move on now. <laughs> so this one pretty much says that there's an ex trying to come back into my life. That ain't it, sis. <laughs> So, I don't think that's accurate at all. Okay, so it pretty much says there's going to be a big change in my life. And a guy is going to be the main vector of this change. This man could trigger something important. He will act. I don't like this. Okay. So, it says I just have to be careful that a guy in my life does not ruin relationships with other people, which I'm not worried about. <laughs> and then it says the third card indicates that his intentions are positive. They're also very friendly and cordial. Um, does he want more than a friendship? It is not nice. I feel like this is not interesting to you guys, but like I am freaked out by this website. I'm creeped out. <sighs> so that was really scary. <laughs> I'd say my overall like, my overall review of these apps and stuff. <laughs> Um, I don't think the apps are very accurate, and the website was, like, half on, half off. Like, the stuff that they had right were, like, very, very accurate to what was going on in my life right now. But then the stuff that was off, I couldn't even, like, I was trying to reach for connections, and I was like, I can't think of anything. Yeah. Well, I'm going to go have a crisis, um, just because I'm creeped out, because I don't really believe in that stuff, but, like, that was really creepy. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I hope you like this video. Come back next week for who knows what. Thanks for watching, like, and subscribe, and we will see you next week. Bye!